Despite the Ford Taurus having once been the best-selling car in the U.S. for a number of years, the current full-size sedan, which was last refreshed for 2013, has struggled against the tide of newer, mid-size cars. Witness Ford selling more than five times as many Fusions in the first quarter of 2016. Although a redesign of the Taurus is due soon, provided Ford doesn't kill it off entirely, the current model soldiers into 2016 with only modest updates to its aging formula. For this final test of the current car, we revisited a front-wheel drive model fitted with the optional 2.0-liter Echo Boost engine, very similar to a Taurus we tested in 2013. Big and Small The Taurus is comfortable, reasonably handsome, if chunky looking, and priced to start at less than 30 grand, but its weaknesses are largely a factor of the ancient Volvo-based platform on which it rides. At more than 200 inches long and 60 inches tall, this Ford casts a giant shadow. Yet there's noticeably less room inside than in other large sedans, such as the Chevrolet Impala and the Hyundai Zara. Even some of the mid-size cars in our last comparison test surpassed the Taurus's interior volume and rear seat comfort. The biggest return on the Ford size is its cavernous, 20 cubic foot trunk that's capacious enough to swallow a golf bag for each of the car's five occupants, 